Hands up. Kill was one necromancer. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna open it up here. I'm gonna see if I can do this without breaking anything. So I already cut the tape because I needed to make sure I could open. So this is how it looks when you first open it. Super quality, right? Super quality. Lots of lots of bubble wrap, so I'm gonna have to pop that at some point. Oh boy, what is this first thing? Ooh, these are nice. These are nice. This is the the Terrian coins. Damn, and they have weight to them. I want like an entire little bag of this. These feels are they like stuck onto it? How does this work? I guess they're like glued. I don't want to put them off, but they they are so amazing. Like I can't even describe this, but this is like super heavy. Yeah, like like it's It's not as heavy as my phone, but it's like still pretty sizable. Damn, it's so heavy. Oh yeah, and let's let's just get like a super close up of all of these. This is how they look. That is amazing detail. I would legit like Turing Gazette, goes to collective or whatever you're called. Hook me up. I want like a bazillion of these. These, they feel so nice. And they're like, by the way, actual metal. It seems. That's a good start. It's a really good start. Popping bubble wrap is in nation sports during a pandemic. Yeah. Then we have this uh, this box thing. I guess that was what this one was supposed to be packed in originally. But it was just like flat. So. Exactly, Dark Moon. A full sack of them. Just a full sack. That would be so good. Okay. Now to the big thing. Oh my god. Shit. Okay, no. We actually have... Okay, so first of all, I'm just gonna take this one out, because that... Okay, I had to compact the, the, the coin case. Should build easily. Okay. Uh, I am just gonna take this one and throw it away, because that has my address on it. We don't want to show that. Um, then we have some stickers. Ooh, this is like a lot of things. This is a lot of things. Let's see. Okay, so first, first we have some some baby, no, just just general stickers. I thought it was baby mounts first, but it's not. Stream meeting at Reddish backyard. If I had a backyard, we could do that. Let's go. But I don't. But th these look pretty cool. These look nice. I, as always, I'm probably not going to use the stickers because I don't tend to use stickers. I tend to collect them and just save them for uh, for the future, just like I did with the Turian Tarot. And we have another thing here. Ooh, that looks nice. Like a shiny postcard kind of thing. That's so shiny. Ooh. What else do we have? So cute, your sub badge disappeared. Yeah, just, just for like a brief second it disappeared. Can't, can't have your sub badge all the time. So then we have a, a, a... I guess a calling card kind of thing from the... Goes to Artist, Artist Collective. These are the people behind this one. So it's not actually Arena that behind it, right? Can you, can you like focus on this one? Thank you. I think it has a hard time focusing on it. But yeah. These are the people behind the whole thing. They also did the Tyrion Tarot, and it's super nice. It's super nice. It, it actually feels good, this one. So, we have... Ooh! We have Choya stickers. We have a bunch of small Tyrion Gazette Choya stickers. There we go. Look at these small ones. Can you please just... autofocus properly? It doesn't want to autofocus properly. There we go. But these look kind of, these look kind of cute. You have, have like one cooking. Then you have, have one in like a, a tub kind of thing. You have like the flying one. Then you have the little Halloween one, which is very appropriate. It comes out at Halloween. Halloween Choya. Also the, the, the finish, the, the print finish and get your design deck card. Wow. Oh. 
So this, ooh, this looks nice too. There's also a shiny. That looks so nice. Choi has a perfect, yeah. This actually has, this has a note from the team. So I kind of want to read this out loud. So let's just uh, get the mic in and get ready for this. We can't thank all of you enough for the patience you've shown as we've worked to get these books out. We know that nothing has been as expected in the last few months, and we weren't an exception to the rule. So for your kindness and patience, thank you. This book has been something we've been eager to show off since last year. It's a testament to thousands of collective hours of work, and all put to, towards a good cause. With your help, we donated another $11,500 to charity. Extra life, by the way. Damn, that's a lot of money. 11000 Almost halfway to 12000 Marking over $60,000 donated under our name. We are proud of this and the projects that we've made. We hope you feel similarly. That said, as everyone knows, the COVID situation has turned the world upside down. Everyone has been impacted in different ways for artists. Many of us, including people in this book, won't be able to attend shows to sell our work, which was where we saw most of our sales for the year. To attempt to help, we've created a GoFundMe for the creatives that have worked for free in our projects, and we will split funds raised equally between artists who request aid so long as they've worked with us in the last two years. And funding storage for these books, the elongated continuing shipping, Oh, the elongated continuing shipping and fulfillment that we've still provided for free. Yeah, so th there's been a bunch of extra things that have, but like, yeah, they basically, let's let's just put it like this. I think these were supposed to ship like in spring. They're like half a year late, pretty much. So, yeah. Also, we know not everyone can support monetarily, but if you can share the link below, it would help immensely from all of us hoping to make a bit of wonder. Thank you. Link gofundme.com slash f slash alchemy art. Melanie Sayer and Sarah Squires. These are the owners of Gilles 2, or of Alchemy Art and Gilles 2 Artist Collective. So, yeah, go go to that link, peoples. Can we can we get it sharp? Can we get it sharp? Camera, get it sharp. There we go. Go go to the link. Go to the link, peoples. Go help support them. Oh, and that that cool that super nice things here. That super nice thing with the. That, by the way, this is like. This is like not not just flat either. It's like embossed almost, but it's an actual postcard. So if you want to send a cool postcard to someone you like, send a postcard. Easy. Okay, so we gotta we gotta take the box here. We're gonna move it a bit. Then we have the. Damn, is this like? Is this how big the book is? Is this how big it is? It's like, I don't. I don't even know. I feel like there's a lot of that's what she says jokes in there, but oh. can we can we just like it's like wrapped in both ends. It's kind of cute. Oh my god. This feels oh, it has such a smooth finish. Damn, that is like I don't even know. Like this is giant. Sora, thank you, man. Thank you. Holy shit. This looks insane. This is insane. Like crazy. Wow. Then you have, oh, I guess it's supposed to be like that. It says Turinga set. You hate and love people taking off the bubble wrap. We can, I, I can give you some. It's, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Can, can we find some bubble wrap that's like satisfying? There you go. You're welcome. I hope that's good for you. Now, now, don't, 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 don't love and hate me now. <laughs> Just love me. <laughs> also, Chrome, it, it's so freakishly heavy. It's so much larger than I thought. Oh, 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 yeah. I, I, th oh, <laughs> that's amazing. <laughs> okay, you ready? You ready? Okay, let, no, actually, let's start with the back. Let's start with the back. There we go. Oh, you've wrapped 1,400 of these? Oh, boy. <laughs> these books are insane, by the way. Please keep making them. So this is the back of it. I'm going to try to avoid... Wait, did they do a shiny... They did a shiny version of the partner logo. That one. That's so cool. That's so cool. So, 
Let's do another reveal here. We're, we're just gonna we're gonna turn it around. So you hate it and you love it. Thank you for your service. Yeah. This this one is gonna be the big one. So I got I got Astralaria, right? So look at look look at this. <gasps> oh my god, it's insane. It looks so crazy. Just look at that color shift. Damn. Like this looks this is so cool. Sorry, I just have to look at it myself a bit as well. Damn, that looks nice. That's so cool. You got eternity, yours was just Shep. CC, I hope you get it soon. Okay, so let's 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 have a look. Let's have a look. This just this already looks amazing. Like <gasps> Look at him, he's there. He's just selling apples. Don't tell anyone. It never captures well on stream. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a bit hard, but at least I have a lot of lighting in here so it can show a bit, but it's really hard to. Saiten, oh, Saiten was there as well. I didn't even notice. Like, look at that, we have Saiten. Wow, this is insane. By the way, I don't think I'm gonna go through all the pages because there's a lot. Oh my god, does it smell like fresh book actually? It does. It does smell like a fresh book. <laughs> so we're gonna okay, we're gonna we're gonna open on some random pages and then we're gonna see what pops up, okay? That's what we're gonna do. That's so colorful. That is cool. Join the pact, that's what you should do. It's the story of the pact commander, the opening. Oh, that is so cool. I didn't even realize. So this is apparently the story of the pack commander. Sorov, thank you for so much for, for giving us some insight here. This is, this is, honestly, when I ordered this, I thought it was going to be like Tyrion Tarot size. Let me just find that again. Just, just anyone who has the Tyrion Tarot. Let's, let's do a size comparison. This is the difference. <laughs> this is it's it's so giant. They're about the same thickness though. Yeah, they're equally thick. Equally thick. Oh yeah, that's true. You have a uh, Destiny's Edge over there. It's it's hard. I'm mirrored by the way on stream, so it's 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 hard to see like move my hands in the right direction okay so let's so we set what request of page 69 that's what we're gonna do the tarot was for the deck absolutely so page 69 that's page 20 that's page not have a number 100 and something oh my god not all the <laughs> by the way this looks insane just looking through it 69 where are you i, I want to find you I like this though. Actual ads in the magazine. <laughs> this is great. Actually doing ads. Let's go. Yeah, absolutely. Sora, by the way, uh, if you take requests of things you want to do, you did so well with the Tyrion Tarot, but an actual playing card game, like, like, like actual playing cards, would be insane. I would love that. I know there's not as much creativity you can do on that one, maybe, but I would love it personally. I really like playing cards. So what page is... Why is there not page numbers on so many of them? This is hard. Oh, 80. We're at page 80. Let's find out. Oh, 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 this is almost erotic. This is almost erotic. Why is he, why is he dressed? Isn't he supposed to be in his speedos? If you don't remember the theme of the book, oh, it was something like, um, uh, maybe I should read that actually, but we still need to find page 69. <gasps> We're here. So 67, 68, 69 is that page there. It is, it is a blank page, but it's right next to Lord Farron. It is right next to him. That's the Swordmaster. So let's go back to the intro. 
let's read it because it's been a while okay so we have we have this little quote thing here so i'm gonna read that out loud it is imperative that we preserve our knowledge of the past that we might use it to guide our steps into the future that is deep that's deep so this is volume 224 written in 1332 ae colossus we got we got an interview with Lord Farron. That is what is in here. You have to mute me now. All right, take care, CC. Thanks for joining. This is, by the way, this this is such a heavy book. <laughs> so heavy. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna read this uh, this introductory page, right? I'm gonna reach that or read that. It's a quote from the game. Oh yeah, definitely. Sora, I I recognized it, but yeah, it's nice with quotes from in game. It's cool. It expands the universe, you know. So, Tyrion Gazette, Volume 224, 1332 AE Colossus. This project by the Gilgamesh 2 Art Collective, or Artist Collective, brings artists and writers from all over the world banding together to create a new experience. Actually, let's get the mic a bit closer so we can get the good sound. Stepping into the world of Tyria through an in-world magazine. While playing Gilgamesh 2, We've lived the story of the hero, the enduring commander, but it can be easy to fall out of touch with our beginnings as we struggle and fight on distant shores. Back at home in the five great cities, things are still happening. Life in Tyria continues, even when we're not looking, and magazines like this tell us about the going-ons in the world that we cannot see for ourselves. As you read through this book, we hope you'll look at the project from the perspective of someone living in Tyria. Not the commander, but just your everyday citizen. We tried to tackle subjects as true, uh, or as a true magazine, or that. I'm jumping lines here. <laughs> we tried to tackle subjects as a true magazine would, asking ourselves what ads would be running, what concerns a citizen, uh, what concerns a citizen would have, and what would be the most relevant to the readers if they were picking up this book from their local newsstand. That said, thank you for joining on this on this journey, and we hope you will enjoy our latest artistic adventure into Turia. It is it is beautiful. Yeah, the bubble wrap was beautiful. The bubble wrap was best. So we're just gonna we're just gonna get some some random snapshots here. This is just me. Does anyone have page requests? By the way, by the way, the, these things look insane. They look so good. I it, it, I bet you stream cannot even capture it. I think this is my favorite. Come find your new die with Lakaid in the Traders Forum? Craft your hue. That, th oh, this looks so, this looks so much better in real life, by the way. It feels like on stream, it looks much more blue. And then again, I'm, I'm colorblind, so yeah. Now you want it, where can you get this book? Um. The thing is, I, Sora might be able to tell you, but I don't know whether there is any more available. It was an Indiegogo that happened a year ago. Like one year and two months ago. But hey, like, like, but oh, oh, I actually have a thing. Sora, please do more projects, not for me, but such that Roy can buy a toaster next time. <laughs> he needs a toaster. Roy needs a toaster. We need to get Roy a toaster. So... Please, please do more projects and get Aina to sponsor more toasters. This is so good looking. Look at this. Wow. This is amazing. Wait, did you, <laughs> did you spawn inside them? Get wrecked. So we're gonna, again, if anyone has page requests, we can open specific pages. Okay, so this one says, Come play all day and feast all night. The ale will flow, the kegs take flight. There, there are tales to share and songs for all. Pull up a chair at the keg brawl. That is a good, that is well done. That is well done. I like this. That is a well done one. Let's see, what else do we have? What else do we have? Yeah, we 
Okay, so Sorev, since you're here, I have to ask, was that was there a mistake in the book or what? Since there's a, a sticker here, was that a mistake in the book or something? I'm I'm just curious, like like, just curious on the whole process. Cause it just ended up on that page and yeah, it has a sticker for the text. That was the Farron. We've seen you. Oh my God, there's so much Farron in this book. Like, is he really that popular for the average citizen of Terria? Like, I don't even know. This looks pretty damn good as well. Look at this. Aromatic magic from the Garden of Seberin. So, is it you? Contact our representative in Lion's Edge. Terria's next top designer. Let's go. It was, it was something you couldn't retract due to COVID. Oh, feels bad. But I'm, I'm glad you uh, you found a solution for it, though. I feel like I'm just getting back to the same pages now. Ooh, this looks nice as well. Look at this. The jet. Everything just looks great here. We ended up manually covering them with stickers. Going to get PTSD from that, I can imagine. I can imagine. That must be a lot of work. A lot of work. Unique chic street fashion across Terria. Let's go. That is there is so much content. I I will literally sit and have to go through this book. Oh you have a what is that? That's a high leg. There's high legs here. Oh my god, there is a script with shiny fashion. There is a script with shiny fashion. That is that is quality. Also, now you want to play as a Koden. I think we're a lot of people who actually want to play as a Koden. The closest you can get is the, the infinite Koden tonic. Wait, what? Wait, what? Tired of writing and reading, losing messages, slow delivery, flash, F-L-A-S-H, fast letter, assisting service herald, Turbo Accelerator, Guidance System, Destination Log. Only $399.99. Look at that. You can you can literally get your mail delivered in a flash. That's beautiful. So sorry, you're gonna post on, on Twitter and such if you end up having more left over, right? This, oh my god, stream doesn't even cover it. This looks so much. How much was this? Uh, like the book? Um, honestly, I can't remember, but I can go check. Let's check. Just put this aside. Uh, I know the toaster was 210 US dollars. That much I know, because I remember that very explicitly. Let's see. Turian cassette. Uh, contribution receipt. So, in total, well, I paid extra later. So, probably about 300 euros, something like that, with the toaster included in that price. The Turian, or the Turian cassette that I got, I think that was an early one. So, that was a bit cheaper, but that was 33 US dollars. Then I had $30 shipping to the U to, to Denmark. Uh, the toaster was 210 US dollars. I think I got the I got the changed cover here. I got that later on that. I think that cost a bit extra and Then I just paid import taxes, which was about 30 euros as well <laughs> So in total like for shipping I paid 60 euros. Yeah, we don't do reruns just selling extras can follow up. Okay, awesome yeah, I'll, uh, Gabo, I'll, I'll try to share in Discord and such if uh, if I ever notice that they're selling the extras. Uh, 33 US dollars is what it says on my receipt, so. Or maybe I actually didn't get the early one. Maybe, I, d I don't remember if there was like a lower tier. There, there usually is on Kickstarters and Indiegogos and such. Again, I just want to put this up because this looks insane. This looks insane. I don't, e I don't even... <laughs> I don't even know. This just looks I want I legit legit give me this and make it like a full wall of mine. That would be amazing. 
So, what else do we have? There is a lot of interviews and such in here that I have to read through at some point. Hey, can we can we buy some uh, consortium guided tours, fractals of the mists? I like that art style, by the way. It looks really cool. The base file was massive. <sighs> you shouldn't tempt me. You shouldn't tempt me. I have to. I have a tendency of spending way too much on stuff like this. <laughs> I mean, again, I, I bought the, I bought the toaster, so yeah, that's 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 kind of me. Also, all of Tyria at your fingertips without leaving the comfort of your home. That's nice. That's nice. What time is it, by the way? Oh, we've been going at it for half an hour. By the way, I'm I'm probably gonna cut all of this down and make a YouTube highlight out of it as well. Um, best diving location. Brisbane Wildlands, near East End Waypoint. Okay, okay. So there is an advertisement for the best diving spot over here. So what does it say? It says, for daring explorers, friendly fauna, and local script population, discover and enjoy Tyria's hidden beauties. Sponsored by the consortium. Oh. Yeah, like toaster life. Sorry, it, it was legit. I, I saw the toasters were there. Well, there was one toaster at the time I saw it, and I immediately rode my girlfriend because I've been wanting one of the Ghost 2 toasters since 2013 or so, uh, since I got to know that there were a thing. And I saw there was one, and I felt like it was a bit steep, but of course it was to charity, so that was nice. And I rode her, and I was like, I want this? Should I get it? It's this price. And she was like, you want it, right? And I was like, yeah. And then she was like, you should get it. And I was like, okay. <laughs> so we chose to get it. Um, that being said, let's find the dining, the diving location here. Um, let's see if we can find that. So I'm just gonna, also let's, uh, swap over to our Guild Wars 2 scene, actually. Because I feel like the unboxing is a bit over. But we're gonna find this place. We're gonna find this place. Oh boy, this, this entire book, man. Dude. Quality. I honestly, it, I really wish that it was just more Guild Wars 2 merch in general. Also, East End Waypoint. So, where even is that? I have no clue. Oh, East End Waypoint. There should be a diving spot somewhere. You want Gilda's keyboard to come back? Or keyboard? I can show you, dude, if you want to see it. Maybe I should. I should probably hang that in like my my next place. Oh, this is it, I guess. This is the diving spot. Oh, and there's even diving goggles here. Of course there are. This is the, the place illustrated in the books. By the way, this looks amazing on these higher graphics that I started being able to run. That is very well made. As a... As a pretty... Pretty good interpretation of that. Uh, also, Sorav, by the way, do you have more coins by any chance? <laughs> also, Tyrian economics update, by the way. Actually, economics articles. That is quality. Spreading the holiday cheer. Oh, that was the keg roll thing. <gasps> Oh my god! There is a panda! <laughs> There's a red panda, it's so cute. That's amazing. You tried pretty strict fidelity? Yeah, it's pretty cool. Also, fancy cat association. Do you like cats? Are you a cat? Then we want you. Our rare breed of judges are searching for the finest cats in Turia, and you could be the cat's whiskers. Uh, oh, and there's a star and it says not literally down in the corner. <laughs> Confirm your entry at our offices in Divinity's Reach and be prepared for the cat walk. That is, uh, yeah, this guy is a fancy cat. Um, 
it'll be available on Crest with the other books. Okay, I'll, I'll have to look out for that because honestly, I would love like an entire pouch just full of these coins because <laughs> the coins feel really good. They really have some quality to them. That's well done. Well done on the on the on the coins. Ooh, there is even uh, gift ideas for uh, Winter's Day. So if you have a friend or anything who needs a, a gift for Winter's Day, then you should definitely go for that. Hey, there's, uh, while evil slumbers, the adventure continues. There's even advertisements for Super Adventure Box. That is quality. Oh, boy. But yeah, so far, from what I've seen out of this, would definitely recommend. Even though it's pretty much impossible to get at this point, but that's how it is. That's how it is. I like it, though. And it's going to go up on my shelf somewhere behind me. Somewhere out there. And hopefully people will be able to see it on stream together with other things. I just need some more lighting behind there because you can't see that much. But yeah, this is... This book is heavy. It feels quality. I am I'm incredibly satisfied with my purchase. Also, sorry, we just skipped scene there. Let's just go back to that one. Tyrion Tarot, or no, wait, not Tyrion Tarot, Tyrion Gazette. There we go. That was uh, that was the unboxing experience. That was that was quality. <laughs>